Hey y'all, welcome to Saturday Suds on Uncle Bub's Bell Buckle Beer Reviews. Hey, today I've got another beer from a brew club, and today's brew is a, from the Shipyard Brewing Company. It's called Export American Golden Ale, 5.1% alcohol by volume. Hope y'all can see that okay. Uh, so, a little bit about this brew, uh, the, the brewing company, they were founded in 1984, um, family-owned brewery, uh, rooted in tradition, brimming with innovation, all that kind of good stuff. Man, they, uh, they are the largest craft brewery in Maine, um, and they're out of Portland, Maine, that's where they're at, but the largest craft brewery in Maine. So we're going to try this brew today on Saturday Suds, and I'm just tickled to death. I'm just tickled to death. Being a dumb old redneck here in Bale Buckle, Tennessee, I get to try a craft brew from Maine. And I would not be able to do this if it wasn't from a beer club. So we're gonna try this day on Saturday Suds. Looks like it's a screw top, let's see. Yep, it is, it's a screw top. Oh, it's pretty coming out of the bottle. Mmm, oh man, look at that. Look at that, that is a beautiful golden brew. Dead gum, look at that. Look at that head. <laughs> Man, I love beer, y'all. It's just a beautiful thing. I so enjoy watching a brew, especially for the first time if I don't know a brew. Seeing it poured, it is bright. It's Man, the bubbles are just, just bouncing up through there. Feeding that beautiful head. All right, so I'm in a brew club, y'all. I get 12 brews a month, two from two different breweries, and I get three of each one. This one is Export Ale, Export Golden Ale. All right, so it says this flagship ale was engineered based on English tradition and is brewed with the finest ingredients sourced wherever possible from local main farms. And an American golden ale, it offers hints of malty sweetness, distinct hop aromas, finishing clean and crisp, refreshing to almost any palate. A classic brew which continues to lead the way as a drinkable, well-balanced, and flavorful ale. So, I mean, it looks delicious. And that head, man, look at that. Right, so I've poured this off and that head is just laying in there. It's already got lacing on the glass. Look at that. You see that? See that lacing? Already got lacing there. That's, to me, y'all, the little bit of lacing on the glass says quality. And you know, they've been around since 1994 and Maine's largest craft brewery. It's a pretty brew, dead gum. That up there from my buddy Chad so you can see it. Now, this is Maine, Portland, Maine, it's where this stuff brewed at. I don't know how widely available it is to everybody, but I'm lucky enough to get to try it here in Bell Buckle, Tennessee, and I'm tickled to death to be able to try it for you. I don't get a lot out of the aroma. Mmm. That head has a, a rich, rich flavor to the head. A little bit of bitterness on the finish, but. Kind of a bready flavor. Beautiful, beautiful gold brew. I mean, just pure, pretty as it can be. All right, so this export ale is for all American workers. Hey, I love and appreciate y'all. Thank you for what you do to support our economy, support yourselves, pay your own way, support your family. Man, it's important because we all depend on each other. And I so appreciate what y'all do. And it don't matter what you do, it don't matter how many hours you work. If you're working to support yourself and your family, you're important and you're essential. I don't care what anybody says. 
Thank you, American Worker. This export ale is for you. Mmm. Like it's, it's got a crisp and clean flavor. I get just a, I mean just a barely a note of caramel in the flavor of it. Mmm. Man, that is good. Dad gummy. Y'all, leave me a comment. Hey, if you would like to know my beer club where I get these brews, leave me a comment and I will I will put it in the I will leave a, a comment back where I get these brews from. This is I, I got one more shipment, I think, of these brews, and I'm gonna renew my beer club because I have just really enjoyed most of the brews I've gotten from them. I have really enjoyed them. And these are brews that I would not be able to try if it wasn't for my brew club. So, hey, if y'all like the videos, there's a little beer mug right there. If you're on your computer, if you're on your phone, you probably won't see it. Y'all subscribe, hit like, share, notification bell, like garbage. Leave me a comment. Leave me a comment, man. Let me know a brew that you would like for me to try. If I can find it, I would love to try it for you. There's so many out there. And, you know, there's so many that I don't have access to that I would really like to try. But I'm trying to try some different beers uh, that are available to me here in my area. <clears throat> so I'll be back next week for our Wet Your Whistle Wednesday. Trying a different beer for you. Hey, I love and appreciate y'all. Y'all stay tuned. Take care. Cheers, y'all.